Hello ladies and gentlemen, MarauderX here back with more Let's Play Pokemon Crystal. Uh, so we cheated a little bit and we're gonna do something. Um, so we changed the time and we changed uh, Selvaria's happiness. And now we are going to use that rare candy that we got. Yes. For all the other cheating that we're, we're doing, we didn't cheat the rare candy. We didn't cheat. We didn't. This time. <laughs> this time. Uh, we're going to use the rare candy on Selvaria. And this is going to level her up through to 21. Stats. What? Selvaria is evolving. And Selvaria evolves to Umbreon, and that's the one that we wanted to go for because this is, it's a tank. That's why we, we got this one. Yeah. Like, like, we now have a, a wall. So, which we're just going to enhance that later on by giving it, like, double team. Yeah, we're, we're just, we have a brick wall. Not that we need one, but we figured... Why not? Yeah. Though, looking at um, Umbreon's moveset, uh, it's going to be a while before it learns anything useful. It wouldn't be, like, a terrible idea to go and give it Shadow Ball. I, I can do that. Um, give me one second. I'm going to go and we're going to turn off the, uh, the cheats just so that they don't adversely affect anything else. So give me one second. We're going to do that. So... I was looking at it, Umbreon's offensive sets are really not very impressive at all. Um, it's, it's just her defensive stats are amazing. Okay, so we're back, and you said we should probably teach it Shadow Ball? Yeah. Uh, let's see. Umbreon's offensive stats are not amazing, but uh, they'll do all right. And uh, Shadow Ball's ghost, so it's based off of attack, unlike Dark, which is based off of special attack. But Umbreon's attack is actually higher than special attack. Really? Yeah. Not by a lot, but it is higher. All right, so we have to delete an older move. What do we? What do we have on Silvaria? <laughs> What do we need to tackle? Uh, tackles okay. Tail whip, sand attack. Uh, Pocket I... sand. <laughs> cha cha cha. Yeah, get rid of sand attack. Get rid of sand attack. One, two, and poof. All right, there we go. Uh, is there anything else that we have that might? I don't think we have anything else that Savari can learn. Nightmare, Cut, Surf, Flash... Can she... Can Savaria learn Flash? <laughs> uh, the, the question is, why would you want to? Well, between Flash and Double Team... Uh, I mean, we just got rid of Sand Attack. Sand Attack would have been better, because... Sand Attack has 100% accuracy. Flash has 70. Oh, hey, there's a... Uh, I'm glad I looked... I was like, if I just walk up there, that looks like it's gonna be story related, but there's an item over here that I can't get to. Screw you. Okay, I, I have to go through here. Alright, so we've got... Let's look at this. Its breathing is terribly labored. This Pokemon always kept the sea lit at night, but suddenly got sick. It's gasping for air. I understand that there is a wonderful pharmacy in Cinewood. Sino? Cyan wood? That's a weird way to spell cyan. Uh, that's across the sea, and I can't leave Amphi unattended. May I ask you to get some medicine? Sure, why not? Let's, we'll go get medicine. After we take this item. Yay, super potion. Alright, so... Now we just leave? Yeah, you can just drop down the holes to get back faster. Well, I I have to do that because there's no way out from here, and yeah, Billy there's just gonna keep spinning around in circles. So let's just 
drop down the hole. And drop down the hole. Drop down the hole. And another hole. More holes! How am I not dead? <laughs> Hello, I'm uh, Shia LaBeouf. <laughs> uh, dark roads are dangerous at night. But in the pitch black of night, the sea is even more treacherous. Yeah, so I was looking at uh, Umbreon's DMs, and I'm not really sure how this works, but apparently she can learn cut. Okay. Um, do we surf? Maybe just through sheer power of emo? <laughs> <laughs> My Umbreon is so emo, it learns cut. <laughs> um, do, do we just surf here? Yeah. Like, okay. And... Did we heal up the Pokemon Center here? Uh, I don't think I have since we came out of the tower, so I should probably do that before going on an adventure in the water. I, I was just thinking it would be useful to do that so when we use teleport, it'll bring us back here. That is also a, a very important thing to, to realize. I was thinking we're getting ready to go into the water. I've got a fire type, a ground type. <laughs> like... Alright, but fully healed no matter what, so we'll we'll go into the water. Uh what's that sign say? What what is that sign? That's Fast mm. Ship Pier, do I Um it's I don't think we can do anything with yeah, this. Yeah, I don't think this is a way out to where we wanna go. Or Yeah, there's there's that's that's not anything we wanna futz around with right now. Watch it be what we want to futz around <laughs> with right now, and everyone who's watching is screaming, No! Go the- Anthony, shut up. I'm not even listening to what you're saying. I'm just smiling and nodding. Alright, so we'll go down here, we'll surf. Bonus, you surf, and... I think we need to surf to the wall. Yeah. And hey, it's a wild tentacle! Oh, and Silvari is still in my number one slot. Okay. Hey, don't... It should be fine. I don't think it's gonna... Uh... I'm just... I'm curious. Oh, okay. That was alright. Mostly because we kind of need to level up Salvaria because she's has done nothing because we were waiting to level her up. Yeah. The, I mean, Salvaria is technically the male, but it's still Salvaria. It's yeah. It's so we can't go that way. So we've got to go to the right. So I'm just gonna peer pressure Salvaria into accepting her <laughs> gender identity. <laughs> Oh, that's that's terrible. That's I, I honestly, well, I paid no attention to the fact that Silvaria is in fact male, and I I named named him after Valkyria. <laughs> like, oh god damn it! I'm gonna yeah. use Repel. Oh hey, it's a tentacle. Hey, you're not creepy looking. If I don't kill you in one hit with uh. Shadow Ball, I'm gonna catch you in a Pokeball. I've seen enough hentai to know where that's going. Oh. Well, your... Tentacruel actually has pretty decent defense. Poison Sting. And I'm... I'm pisoned. Alright. Hurt by the poison. Your the fact that you hurt me with the the poison does more. <laughs> We're using acid. Oh, that's fantastic. All right, I'm gonna. I should be able to catch him now, shouldn't I? Oh, do I? I let the water ball, don't I? That would that, actually that's, be. That's for fishing. Oh, that's for fishing. Oh, that's. Yeah. It doesn't oh. apply when you're just. Well, does it? I think it's just for fishing. Yeah, hooked by a rod. All right. Well, let's try. Regular Pokeball? Uh, let's use a Great Ball. We've got him. Plus, you know, Tentacruel, I think it's gonna have a lower catch rate. 
than your typical Pokemon because, you know, it's evolved. It's got decent stats. Ooh! Hey, I'm gonna switch Silvaria. I've already been poisoned. Uh, should I do another tackle just to... Yeah, I can do that. Weaken him a little bit more. Alright. And... We're gonna use another Great Ball. We have not really caught too many Pokémon in this Let's Play, I've gotta say. Yeah. We, we are doing a pretty piss poor job at catching them all. Alright, um, I'm just gonna kill him. Cause he's gonna kill me. Yeah, I'm- Silvari's dead. So... Let's... Let's switch to bonus, and... I guess I could try another Pokeball? Or I could you just could. kill him. Uh, I mean... It, it, it just depends. Do you want to be the very best? <laughs> like no one ever was. Oh god damn it! I'm, I'm gonna piss all of my money away on using great balls on this goddamn Tentacruel. Catch it! All right, nope, nope. He's he's just dead. He's dead. Dead, and he's gonna poison me again. Yep. Alright, this is, this is becoming, this is turning into an episode of Game Drums is what this is. It's not very effective, but I killed it. Alright, I need to heal my poison. And your dead. And my dead. I have one awakening, don't I? Or one a revive. Yeah. Uh, I mean, we're right by town. Yeah. So we can just... Just do this. Just do that. We need to go to get that water anyway. This water? Yeah. Alright. Heal my Pokemans. Again. Really? Weren't you here just five minutes ago? Well, I went into the water and this giant jellyfish decided to just rip me a new one. Alright, so we need to go here. Yeah. Alright, so... Surfing... Route 40. Oh my god, there's... You have to warm up before going into the water. That's basic. It's basic stuff. That's... Swimmer male Simon. Oh. Alright, sure, whatever. I'm gonna beat you up with Silvari again. The Shadow Ball actually did well. You're level 20. You're, I don't know. Yeah. Special defense help, which doesn't actually help Shadow Ball at all. Yeah. It doesn't help any of my abilities at all. <laughs> but you're dead. Yeah, because we we do need to level up Silvari a little bit because another tentacle. No, I don't want to change Pokemon. I want to just keep beating up on, on this. Alright, Shadow Ball again, and you're gonna Acid me, that's fine. I'm gonna do a couple of Shadow Balls. I love my balls. Balls of Shadows. Balls of shadows. Alright, so, beat you up, and so close to leveling up. Alright, so I just keep going south, because that's what they said, the island is to the south of us, right? Yeah. Ah, son of a bitch! The, the sea is swarming with tentacles. Uh... Alright, so far, at least you'll level up off this one. That's level 15, that should die in one hit. Yeah. And... Enough XP to level up. And we'll just go that way and just... Stop. I knew better. I was like, I should probably use a repel. 
I should use a... And what happened? No! Nope! Didn't use Repel. Oh, you survived! This one has higher defense. Or just a low damage roll. Who knows? Yeah. And I'm confused... And I'm gonna hurt myself in the confusion. You're gonna constrict. Still can't do shit, because, you know, Savaria has higher than average defense. Yeah. The, the, the main damage is going to come from poison, if it poisons me, or the fact that I'm confused. Alright, there we go, you're dead. Leave me alone. Just gonna keep going south, we're on Route 41. I, I hate the water. At least we're not fighting Magikarp. <laughs> 21 tentacle. That's gonna hurt just a little bit. Not really, but it's not going to die immediately. I was expecting it to uh, confuse me again. Instead, it'll poison me. Nope. Nope, no poison. Fantastic. And dead. Okay, so, uh, repel. Yeah. Repel. Cuz I'm I'm just I just I just can't. All right. And all really all that's going to do is lessen lessen the number of random encounters. It's not going to well, remove them. Well, if you switch your frog Pokémon, it'll remove them. It will. Yeah, it's based on the level of your front Pokémon. Ah. You won't encounter anything that's lower level than you. Oh, well, uh, that's higher level than me. That's a level 24 Tentacruel. So yeah, I'll switch out to, um... Which incidentally means that, uh, repels... Using repels with a weak Pokémon... Well, semi-weak Pokémon is a good way to hunt the, uh... The legendaries. Because after you awaken them, they just scatter and can be anywhere. anywhere. But they're level 40. Most wild Pokemon are not level 40. So, if you use a Repel and go walking around with like level 35 Pokemon, the only thing that you can run into is the legendaries. I don't have... What are you looking for? Uh, the only thing I have is the Poison Berry. You have an antidote at the top. Oh, I do have an antidote at the top. Like, why? I, like, I know I had something. Alright. But yeah, if you swap, like, the top to the front, the yeah. repel will work better. I was gonna switch, uh, Pyro to the front. That should be okay. I don't think there's, like, any level 30 tentacles or anything. I'll switch up Morgan. Well, I mean, Pyro and Morgan would be equally bad. They, yeah, they would be equally bad. Ah, damn it. Alright, well... Not stats, I want to switch. I forgot you've got teleport as your top thing. Alright, there we go. And now we just keep going south. Is where we're going? Uh, maybe. This seems correct. Just gonna keep going. Keep going south. We got whirlpools. I take it we don't want to touch the whirlpools? I mean, it doesn't really do anything. Uh, go back to the south and to the west, maybe. That's... I'm gonna, I'm gonna do another repel. Yeah. Like... But yeah, since we don't have the move Whirlpool, like, if we moved into the Whirlpool, it would just instantly send us back in the opposite direction. <sighs> Son of a bitch. At night, star, you gather near the water surface. I don't care. <laughs> Swimmer Windy wants to battle. Horsey, I actually like the the that that series of of Pokemon, and I feel very bad that I'm just murdering it right now. I mean, especially in this game, Kingdra is. You know, like, one of the best water types. 
Yeah, we were actually thinking about uh, putting Kingdra in for a while, weren't we? Yeah, but then we went with the ducks. Then we went with the duck. Why did we go for duck? There was there was a reason we went for duck over Kingdra. I, I think it was just to pair with Farfetch'd. Oh, yeah, yeah. Also, Kingdra is borderline, you know, that overused. Yeah. Like, th this Pokemon's just a little bit too good. You know, I say that as we have a Kadabra. Yeah. Yeah, right there. Alright, so we're here in Sinewood, and we're out of time! So we finally made it. So, uh, I'm gonna just heal- well, No, uh, we don't want to use yeah. the Pokemon, because we want to teleport back. So, uh, no, I'm just gonna finish up what we need to deal with here, and we'll teleport back. But we'll do that in the next episode! So, uh, we'll see you guys in the next installment. Till then, later everyone.